What's good, y'all? Michael here today with another video. Listen, y'all not gonna play me like that. I read my comment section. Because I don't get... See, here's the thing. You keep bringing up, but just because he's on the Bears, I'm gonna say I'm gonna defend him. I'm not. I'm right about him. Why would I need to def Why would I need to criticize the hire when I'm in the right about him? Because here's the thing, but I'm going to be blunt with you. If they hired Mike Pent to be a defensive coordinator instead of a assistant coach as his current role, then I would not like the hire. Okay? I would I would cancel my Sunday ticket football and I would not watch a Bears game until they fire his ass. Okay? Because I'm always time traveling because I'm always time traveling because you'll never see my future. Okay? So I'm gonna. This is February 11th of 2021. We are t time traveling seven months. Okay? The Bears defense is gonna be successful under, under the new defensive coordinator, Sean. Or do you want me to call him Duck? Or whatever. So, it is now September of 2021. Green Bay Pat, Green Bay fans will complain about their defense not stopping the pass and not stopping the run. So, you move on from Mike Penn, who changed Jair Alexander to the best cornerback in the league. Who, argue, like, arguably Green Bay had the number one passing defense in the NFL. And... Realistically, the only difference was they couldn't stop the run. Okay? They couldn't stop the run. That was that was the only problem that they had with Mike Penn. So, if I'm going to be honest with you, if he goes to the defensive coordinator and says, we're going to put Mac as a safety or a cornerback, they're going to laugh him out of the, the training site because they're going to say, man... Man, I hope you're just joking, man. No, listen, we're not going to do what you want to do because you report to me. There is a certain role that he was hired to. If he was a water boy, y'all would still be coming at me. And I don't know why you guys are complaining. Packers fans are going to have... Packers are going to have the worst defense in the NFL in about seven months from now. Because if you thought Mike Pent was bad... Wait until you hear this, because I'm always time traveling. So, I look at, you know, career-wise of the guy that went to the Packers. What, what was his name? Bobby or something? So, Bobby is basically terrible at every category. 32 against the pass and 28 against the run. So, you mean to tell me you would rather have Mike Pent who was only bad at stopping the run, but only good as a passing passing defense? Or you would rather have Bobby, who is basically the worst defensive coordinator I have seen, pick and choose. I'm, t I'm taking my pen. I'm sorry. As as much as Packers fans don't want don't want my pen around, it's better to keep my... It, it, like, check this out. I'm not going to make an excuse for Mike putting Preston as a cornerback. I'm not going to make an excuse for him stopping the run because... But the way he changed the passing, you know, I really have high hopes for our corners. Kyle Ford, Jalen Johnson, Buster Screen. Or depending if we get a new cornerback. And our safeties the most. Okay? At the end of the day, folks... He's not, his role is not important on the Bears. If his role was important, then I would criticize it. But here's the thing. At least Jimmy Graham had a higher role than Mike Pett. Jimmy Graham was a number one tight end. Remember when we overpaid him? We got laughed at by Packers fans. Guess what? He led the team in touchdowns. Okay? I don't want to hear that shit. Green Bay Packers fans... Thinking that we're going to suck? It, no. We're not going to suck. 
you guys are going to suck because if you think Mike Penn is bad, wait until you see Bobby. And I, and I got a bunch of Lions fans that, that know that guy's name and he was on the 0-16 Lions. Lions fans. Would you rather have Bobby or would you rather have Mike Penn? Either way, either way, your defense is, well, at least Green Bay's defense was top 10 under Mike Penn. And at the end of the day, man, if you had a higher role on the table, then I, then I would get it. Then I would understand why. But all these people saying, oh, I'm on Suicide Watch. No, I'm not on Suicide Watch. I'm on Suicide Watch if he is a higher role, as long as he, he, he has a boss to report to. Okay, there's a chain in command. So let me break it down to you. Like Packers fans are two years old because obviously they are. The GM reports to the CEO of the Bears. The coach, Matt Nagy, reports to Ryan Pace. The offensive coordinator, Bill Lazor, and the defensive coordinator, Sean, they report to Matt Nagy. And all the assistant coaches that work with them, that work with the players, they report to Bill Lazor and Sean, a.k.a. Mike Penn. So what makes you think an assistant coach is going to ruin the defense? It'd be one thing if Mike Penn was a defensive coordinator, that he had all the defense, the control. And I'm going to guarantee this to Packers fans that they will have a bottom five defense come September. Okay? And they're going to be complaining and they're going to be whining. Because I know Lions fans do not like Bobby. And if you think Bobby is going to do a better job than Mike Penn, you bugging. Because as much as you hate him, how he... Why did he change? He only played one bad half against the GOAT, Tom Brady. And he actually played a good second half. It's just Aaron Rodgers, Aaron Rodgers choked that whole second half. So let me get this straight. You move on from Mike Pent, who was horrible against the run. Okay, I'm not going to make an excuse for Mike Pent not stopping the run. But to move on from him to a worse version of him... That he not only is he terrible against the run, he's terrible at the pass. So he under Mike Pent, under Mike Pent, Jair Alexander was the best quarterback in the league. What makes you think he's gonna stay that way under probably one of the worst defensive coordinators in the league? I rest my case. Because as much as you might hate Mike Pent, you would want his ass back. But but anyway, he doesn't have an important role, so that's it. That's all. Subscribe to the unit. As always, my name is Michael, and I approve this message.